Hi everyone, welcome back to our lesson on Get Smart Plus 3, Module 8, Where Were You Yesterday? With me, Teacher Grace. In today's lesson, we will be looking on the story of our world, answering some comprehension questions based on the student's book, completing exercise in our workbook, and we are going to have a project. So let's read along to this story of our world, Social Studies. This is a picture of New York City in the year 1900. It was very different then. There weren't any shopping centres or cinemas, but there were shops and theatres. There weren't many cars back then, but there were lots of horses and carriages. The streets of New York City weren't quiet. They were noisy and full of people, just like today. So now let's try to answer some comprehension question based on what we have read. So based on the reading just now, what was there in the New York City in the year of 1900? Do they have shopping malls? No. Do they have cinema? No. Do they have rows of shops? Yes, they do. So we're going to put a thick. Do they have a theater? Well done. They have theater. Do they have bus? Mm -hmm. I don't think so. How about car? Do they have car back then? Yes, they do. And do they have carriage? Yes, they do. So make sure all four pictures are being thick. Let's go to the exercise on our workbook on page 62. Which one was Mr. Miller's town 80 years ago? Let's read the description. 80 years ago, there weren't any shopping centers in my town. There were only small shops. There weren't many cars, but there were lots of bikes. The streets were quiet Sometimes there were police officers on horses. There were two theatres, but there weren't any cinemas. Which picture best fit this description? Let's underline the keywords that we have. There weren't any shopping centres, so there's no shopping centres. 80 years ago in Mr. Miller's town. There were only small shops, weren't many cars, not many cars, but there were lots of bikes. The streets were quiet, quiet streets, and there are police officers on horses. There are two theaters, no cinemas. So let's see, in picture A, we have small shops, no shopping center, no cars, lots of bikes. So we have bikes here, we have small shops here, there are police officers on horse. This horse is not the police officers owning it so it's out so it's not picture A let's see picture B is there any shopping centers in picture B all right there are no shopping centers only small shops okay there aren't many cars oh there are so many cars in this picture um, no bikes but in the description, it says that there are lots of 
bikes. Sometimes police officers on horses. We do not see any police officers on horses in picture B. There were two theatres, no cinema. In this picture, we have cinema but not theatre. So let's look at picture C then. In picture C, no shopping centres, only small shops, no cars in the picture, lots of bikes. Okay, we have bikes here and the streets are quiet we have police officers on horses there are two theater no cinema so the answer is c for the next exercise you will need to look at the picture of this town from the year of 1900 and then complete the passage you may choose the answers given to fill in the blanks. Now, let's check the answers. In the year 1900, this streets weren't noisy they were quiet there weren't any cars but there were horses and carriages there were a few shops and there was a theater too Did you manage to get all the answers correct? Well done! Moving on to the last section of this lesson, which is a project that you will need to do. In this project, you would need to find out more about your town in the year of 1900. You may use Google to find pictures about your town. How does your town look like in the year of 1900? What does the town have? And what does the town don't have? So you may use the pictures and also articles, readings, stories about your town in the year 1900 and write a short description about your town. Once you have done, you may send your work to your teacher or him or her to check. That's all for this lesson. I'll see you in the next one. So take care. Bye.